Hello everybody, the Warrior Panda here. Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play 4 Pikmin 4. Last time we started off with the engulfed castle cave and we re-met one of our arch nemesis, the Water Wraith, unfortunately. Really ate that thing and we're sadly going to have to deal with it further down this cave and we don't have very many Pikmin left. We just have 56 blooping because we lost a lot of it, so that's very sad, but... We're gonna have to make do with what we have. No tar, attack! There we go. Now at least we have two of these, uh, get some nectar. Do this and let's try to attack this enemy. Come on, there we go, there we go. So over here we have this enemy. Come on, do your slammy slam. This pluck that out. It's a potato. Just want to make sure it doesn't start. Yeah, shoot, it shoots electricity. Die! There we go. Let's smash this down. And now let's press the button to open the gate. Here and take out this enemy. I wonder if even like the water race is gonna come, come up in this level. I'm pretty sure it will. So we can move base here. And let's come this way. So we can Bring down. Oh, crap. Oh, I guess that was gonna work. Dang it. I'm kind of wasting time here. And now it's being pulled down. Come on, attack. Come on! Uh. Die already! Here we go! Get some spicy spray and some nectar! That. Okay, now so over here. Let's smash this. There's some more nectar. 
Okay, we're all, we are done here. I don't think I even want to waste time with the materials because we already have plenty. I think I just want to head straight to where the, the cave entrance is. Yep, here he is. I'm out of here. Let's go! Alright, sub level four. Sub level four. I'm not gonna deal with that mess. Let's destroy all of these mushrooms. Oh no! There we go! Alright, let's start by building this, these stairs. Here, more of these guys. Yeah. Up here, we can destroy these two mushrooms. That's the exit. Yeah, let's destroy this wall. Now I'll take out these mushrooms. Now grab this. Fruit. Oh crap! Oh no! At least you're down. Oh, that's a big apple. Yeah, I'll let you can take that. Oh crap. Um, yep. Okay, so after a few tries, I only lost one extra Pikmin that I wanted to, but at least I defeated that guy without losing too many Pikmin, so... At least there's progress here. So, we can have... Oh, crap. Uh... We're gonna have to take out that guy. Go. Do that. Do that. Okay, so now I'm just gonna have to try and somehow take care of. Yeah, I'm gonna have to run away. At least it takes care of that enemy. I'll grab this. Here we have... Oh, another one! I don't think I need to destroy those. Oh, crap! Guess I didn't lose anybody. There we 
Got all these mushrooms. Got this racetrack. Come on. Please die. There we go. You grab those. Just a small piece of material. At least that one has some nectar. Okay, we're finally done here, so we can try to leave before anything happens. Like that guy that right there. Good thing I'm done here. That cave actually took a few. That level actually took a few tries. We're at level level, level five now. Just because I kept losing a lot of Pikmin. At least this is the final sub level. We got some liquor. Okay. Um, ooh, I think we're gonna get purple Pikmin here. First time seeing purple pigment in this game. These pigments certainly have some heft to them. Let me check the voice log. There may be a re relevant entry. The purple pigment. One purple pigment has a strength and weight of 10 regular pigment. What they lack in speed, they make up for it in force. When thrown, their impact is powerful enough to emit gra gravitational waves. They're only fo found underground, so I must handle with care. They, they're ten times stronger than uh, their Pikmin. How could they possess so much power? Well, it sounds like we can rely on them for some hefty, hefty lifting. All right, so let's say we're gonna have to use those five purple Pikmin to push some, put some weight on this. go it's one measly end yep here we go we're fighting the lot the water race but at least we have the purple here the attack well nope, I lost one pick then Come on! No pigment lost that time. There we go! Now he's running away. Come back here! At least he can't attack us. Charge! Come on! Done! Finally! And good riddance! And yep, here is the another castaway! Well, I guess I can get a few more purples, why not? Checking the ID info right now. Got fright, freeze, or however you pronounce that, from 
Enohi, a dedicated composer traveling with a famous opera singer and a TV crew, hoping to find inspiration for an upcoming project. Come on. A musician. Looks like he was riding along with the TV crew's ship. Maybe he knows the TV reporter. Okay. So glad I've finally done with this cave. This probably one of the more annoying caves to, to do. We lost a lot of Pikmin. Wait, no, are we done? Huh? Alright, we have to dig this up. Good thing I checked this before I le left. We have this thing. Whatever that is. Go. Now we're done. Okay, let's leave. Got a quibble prop pup drives from that. We also got Noble Goo. Glinty circular or disc that's an intent though GameCube disc. Turn of events track. Difficult choice totem. I insect condo. Velvety dream drop. Memory fragment bottom probably. Scaly custard. Child of the earth. Daughter of the earth. Fresh nuggets, vanishing cookie, juicy gaggle, ice sword, secured satchel, and hoop of passion. And investigation complete. So good, we don't have to go there ever again. Hated that water wraith. At least I knew now how uh, how enough how it worked for there to not be too many issues. So yeah, um, we can have ten purples with us. The water's lowing, levels lowering again. Fifty, it's worth a few, fifty percent of this area, which is awesome. Now let's uh, have Ochi pick up another scent. We come back. Oh boy, uh, uh. Hi. Now it looks like we can get some nectar off of this. This is first is where these guys are. And let's grab some nectar. Break these eggs for some hopefully more nectar. I think everyone's good on the nectar part. We also have Ochi that can pick this up. Oh, it's another cave. I'm actually gonna take this food first. And have Ochi pull that. But actually, I want to go over here real quick. So I can make this base over here.
move base. That way I can quickly go over to that cave and actually start it first. We're just going from one cave to the next. Cave we go! A sub zero sauna. The temperature keeps dropping the further I dive in underground. It's as if I'm in a sauna, but the air is stifling cold instead of hot. My spacesuit protects me from, but the wind keeps keep shivering. I wonder if there's a way I could warm them up down here. Okay, so we got those and ices here, so let's get started with that. Now I have to deal with the freezing cold in this area. In sub level one. Okay, so let's start off by using the ices to break this. We got some nuggets here. And uh, have the ices destroy this. Got this guy. There we go. Now let's take you out. There we go. Now we have this uh, kiwi here. At least we have a few ices that don't have nectar yet, but pretty much everyone else here has ne some nectar. So one measly gold nugget. There we go. See what's over here. And let's destroy this. I guess that's the exit. Oh boy, uh... Well, crap. So now we're back here, so... I wanna try and bring this guy over. Come on, notice me. Smash. I'm very careful about this.
There we go. Now you're done. Okay, now we just have to destroy the rest of these ice glaciers. Pikmin! Another new Pikmin type! Why right, Pikmin this time? I can't wait to find out what qualities these little guys have. The white Pikmin, rare, rare white Pikmin come from white candy pop buds that bloom in caves. They're small and notably faster on their feet, but their attacks are lacking. Imbued with enough poison to be lethal to a bulbor. These wildly Pikmin are Resistant to poisonous gas themselves. No? For poison? I'm sure they aren't a threat, threat to us, but I suggest you handle them with care. Okay, so now we have whites here, so we can grab those materials. So now we can use the white Pikmin to break this, as we couldn't before. Now we can grab these gold nuggets. I believe after that we'll, we're done with this level. Yep, we are. And we're free to go. Sub-level two. And yeah, it is pretty frozen here. Oh boy. Oh no, uh... Oh crap, uh... Okay, so we're gonna have to come over here. Over here. Destroy this. Oh crap, oh crap. So oh, we have that guy there. Charge! Pikmin are dying. There we 
go. Please die. These ices here. Where's those, those other two? Oh, there they are. Go. Swear this. Oh, it's his ice things. That's why there's all the ice. Why it's so freezing cold here. This box. And now we can get some more whites. We just gotta destroy the other ice thing that I saw earlier. Yeah, this one here. Now everything's normal. So we finally grab the that guy there in this puzzle piece. to melt. Press the button and now we're going. Thank <laughs> you. 
that, and uh, got this guy. Let's see what his name is. Got Kaya from Nichki, the, the the member of their school's planetary science club. The hours she spends cloud gazing really rarely leads to scientific observations. Kanyuko. Student, another member of the planetary science club. Let's get her back to the teacher and fellow students. They'll be excited to see each other again. Uh, something else? Oh, there's this. This tiny thing. So now we have to freeze the water so we can actually get up. And now we're done here, so we're free to move on. Sub-level 3. We're actually going to continue in the next episode, guys. So, if you like this part, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Leave a like and post a comment about, about what you thought of the video. I'll see you guys next time for more Let's Play 4 Pikmin 4. Have a wonderful day, guys, and peace out.